first time that we are participating in this exhibition as an exhibitor. We used to visit here as visitors. And what a right time to choose because what you see here is basically the presence of all the major OEMs from the bus body and the commercial vehicle segment. And we as suppliers are proud to be associated with them and Pravas. Now, as a showcase of our technology, this is the right platform. Because at the end of the day, all the technologies that are being exhibited on our stall are adding value to the end consumer and the bus body owners and the fleet owners also. So we are showcasing technologies which are futuristic. We are showcasing technologies which are ecological in nature, which is the new thing, uh, environment and sustainability goals. We have technologies which are 10 years ahead of time. We would like to showcase technologies wherein people can feel the difference at the end of the day. So that's the whole purpose of coming to this exhibition. We are at the right platform at the right time. Definitely, uh, there are multiple technologies which we are showcasing and the system. The tradition system has been changing. Earlier system was used to be the three code system, the H primer, the PU primer and the top code. Now technology moved to two code system, which is epoxy primer and the top code system. Then again, technology advanced, it is to wet on wet system. Now the epoxy primer has been wet on wet applied and the paint can be applied over that. There is no sanding required. There is a huge saving in terms of manpower, in terms of consumable, in terms of cost. Overall system makes it more logical, faster and uh, economical for the uh, user. Moreover, I think in terms of technology you are talking about, so we first time introduced as a paint company, any of the paint company has introduced the water based system for the commercial vehicle, which can be the biggest game changer since we are moving to the uh, saving our mother earth, we are moving to EV vehicles. So for the EV vehicle, we strongly recommend our water based system, which can be collaborated as a complete economic system, the green efficient system in which the primer and the clear coat are uh, uh, low VOC compound and the paint is completely water based. So that system can be a unique system for this industry which is the first mover we can say and there are some other technologies which are the need of the hour like a heat reflective. In the uh, summer, peak summer time the temperature goes up to 50 degree in Delhi and the north areas and the vehicle temperature of the metal is goes up to 60, 65 degree and the inside temperature goes up to 70 degree also. It's like a floating burner. So for that we have introduced, launched our heat reflecting coating which can easily reduce the inside temperature from 6 degrees to 15 degrees depending on the shade. So that can be a game changing situation and the solution. There are so many multiple technologies as well like a direct to metal, like a uh, protective film. There are so many solutions which was the need of the industry. I think uh, we are here to showcase the solutions. It is not just paint. We are moving beyond paints. So that's the whole idea about that. The whole thing is that <clears throat> all these technologies are not the way uh, we have the technology and we are giving to the customer. It's the other way around. We actually did surveys. We actually went into the customer you know, ecosystem and tried to find out what is the real need address them by putting our research and development resources into the entire making of the product. So when it comes to economies, that's probably something which we need to keep in, you know, in our mind when we actually went to go for a new product. So awareness, affordability is something which, which needs to be there. It's not India only, affordability has to be there everywhere. Technologies do cost money, but then economies of scale can be derived over a period of time when, they, when the people embrace the technology. The value proposition is so strong as Naveen also mentioned, the heat reflective for example, the anti-graffiti for example, the green efficiency for example. It's not that we have, to, we have to look at government passing laws about low low VOC, we are already there. So that's why I'm saying our technologies are futuristic, they are affordable, we have to be, you know, more, people have to be more aware and we will give them products what they need. That's the whole idea. So just to add on to Mr. Rakesh. Um, it is very truly said, product comes with a cost, technology comes with its own cost. Actually we need to aware people that don't look at the product cost, look at the system and the saving from that. Like he said about the heat reflecting, the biggest saving means well, in the EV vehicle everything is vehicle, everything is working on the batteries, even the ACs. 
right on the fuel if it is not ev it is working on the fuel if it requires the less ac load less engine load definitely the fuel would be lot safer so there are multiple savings which we look at the holistic approach so not the only the product cost so just to add uh, these technology which we are showcasing these are live for the customers for the oem that was identified couple of years back even this year we have identified much more need on which we will start working and we have started working that can be useful for the upcoming years that we are already invested into it okay from a market marketing perspective i'll just add to your question is that yes two years of time we will be the most dominant paint player and beyond paint player in the commercial vehicle industry in india Uh, when people come here, the you know the normal target group here would be bus owners, fleet owners, and they had this uh, thought process that there will be buses and they will see buses, beautiful buses, they will order for the buses. But this has come as a revelation for them because this is something which probably they didn't think that we will be showcasing the technologies, and the feedback has been tremendous. We don't have a single second of you know not being attending to any customer. We have. We have got people from all spectrum, all over India. It's not just South centric. People have come from far north, east, and a lot of foreign delegates also. So since we are expanding beyond the shores of India also, we will. This would be a right platform to attend to those kind of customers. So basically, Nippon is known for the after sale service. In the commercial vehicle, we proudly say our customer are much more satisfied with Nippon just because of the after sale services. So, any kind of support our customer because OEM can sell bus to anywhere in the India. We have a dedicated technical team who are well trained by our global technical manager, Mr. Lewis Taylor. They can handhold the customer, not the OEM or the bodybuilder, even to their customer whom they are selling the bus. If there is any kind of rectification required or bus got damaged during transition, so we provide services across the India, not even within the India. There are few cases in which we supported outside, outside India as well. So we are we are having our training center in Manesar recently, and we are going to even open one more center soon.